join me as I dive into the waters of the Kuros to explore the underwater landscape after that massive M6. 7 earthquake. <laughs> Let's see what changes have happened down there. The Kuril Islands, a remote archipelago in the Pacific, has been rocked by a powerful M6. Seven earthquake, sending massive shockwaves through the coastline. This significant geological event has left many of us wondering about the impact on the region's unique ecosystem. And that's exactly what we're going to explore today. The challenges posed by this earthquake are numerous. And when we talk about underwater ecosystems, the stakes are even higher. The sudden shift in the seafloor can displace entire habitats, throwing marine life into chaos. For local communities, the risks are just as real with the potential for tsunamis and aftershocks putting lives at risk. It's crucial that we understand the full extent of the damage to ensure the safety of both humans and animals. As we delve into the aftermath, it's clear that the earthquake has triggered a chain reaction of events that will have long-term effects on the region. When we look at the bigger picture, the potential risks to marine life are staggering. The sea floor has been altered and with it the delicate balance of the ecosystem. We are talking about an area that's home to a diverse range of species, many of which are found nowhere else on the planet. It's heartbreaking to think about the potential loss of biodiversity in this unique region. It's not just about the environment, the local communities are also at risk. The earthquake has put their livelihoods and even their lives on the line. We need to consider the human impact of this disaster and ensure that aid and support are provided to those who need it most. As we explore the underwater world of the Kuros, we are met with a landscape that's both fascinating and unsettling. The earthquake has left its mark and the changes are undeniable. From the seafloor to the surface, the effects are far-reaching. 
and it's vital that we document and study this phenomenon to better understand the consequences of such a massive event. One of the most striking aspects of this disaster is the sheer scale of the changes. We're seeing reports of marine species adapting to their new surroundings, but it's a delicate balance that's precarious at best. The visuals coming out of the area are breathtaking underwater landscapes that were once teeming with life are now eerily quiet, a testament to the destructive power of the earthquake. As we watch the footage of the affected areas, it's hard not to feel a sense of awe and respect for the sheer force of nature. The earthquake has left its mark and it's a reminder of the fragility of our planet's ecosystems. The most incredible footage coming out of the curls shows the altered seascape in stark detail. As we summarize the key points discussed today, it's clear that the M6-7 earthquake has had a profound impact on the curls and its unique ecosystem. We've explored the challenges posed by the disaster, the changes to the underwater landscape, and the risks to both marine life and local communities. It's crucial that we continue to monitor these changes to ensure the safety and preservation of this incredible region. If you have any thoughts on the earthquake's impact, please share them in the comments below. And if you are interested in exploring more geological events, be sure to check out my other videos on similar topics.